Okay, so I'm going to compare two tablets and a cell phone. Um, over here we have my old tablet. This is an Android based ViewSonic G tablet. It's been rooted and keep all these things awake. Um, I want to tell you what the version is of the OS. It is running Android 3.0.1. Um, and over here we have uh, stock Samsung Galaxy S3. Um, it is running Android version 4.1.1. Okay, and over here we have. We have the new ASUS uh, TF700T and it is also running the 4.1.1. So these two are running the exact same version. This is running the older version, the, the ViewSonic. Um, and what I'm going to do is the benchmark. I'm going to do the N22 benchmark. All of them are running the same version of the N22. Uh, just installed it as 3. 0 0.3 I think yes 303 <clears throat> okay obviously I previously previously have ran these you can see the score on the screen um, but we'll start them in order here oops that's not starting back it up um, test again test again test again all right so they're all running now well sorry start test Start test, start test. Sorry, this isn't something I do all the time. <clears throat> right, this one tilted up. Well, actually, it looks like the tablets are upside down for this test. So I'll spin around and make it a little bit more visible. So I did start them in order from the oldest cell phone, the newest tablet. This would be the boring part of the test. Definitely looks like the phone's little head, considering it started before the uh, G tablet. And I believe all these devices are actually different resolutions, so I know the resolution makes a pretty big difference on these test scores. Definitely getting more frames per second out of the G tab on this test. And by the way, I have power saving is turned off on all three devices. It's one thing that people will reply with uh, on my YouTube videos when they see that their scores are different than mine. Um, I mean, the, the two on the left, the phone and the uh, Asus, they're just the stock Android operating system. I haven't done anything with them. Um, 
so there hasn't been any changes and I don't have any crazy software installed. I got a few different applications here, but nothing that should cause any performance differences. All right, so the Asus finished first at 14,126. <clears throat> the CPU scored 7971, GPU 3008, the RAM is 2426, and the IOs are 721. And underneath all that, it shows the processor. It's 1700 megahertz times four, and the screen resolution is 1200 by 1848. The Galaxy S3. The score, total score is 10,938. CPU is 4,096. GPU, 4,039. RAM, 1969 IOs 834 processor is 1512 times 2 and the resolution is 720 by 1280 okay and for the G tablet the total score is 7070 the GPU is 3652 I'm sorry that's CPU is 3652 the GPU is 1807, the RAM is 1317, the IOs is 794, and the processor is 14 megahertz times two. The resolution is 600 by 988. So that's the benchmark. I try to be as, as fair about this as possible when putting these devices together. Um, you know, like I said, all the power settings are turned off, and you saw what version they're on of the operating system, and they're all in the exact same version of Antutu.